reason we're doing the hinge cutting is to create structure for the deer. You know, and it, the good thing about hinge cutting, if you had logging or something like that, it, it can take years for your, for your uh, cover to come up. And this here, it's instant. And, you know, me, myself, I'd wait till the leaves were actually on because it provides food, cover, and, you know, it, the cover's a lot thicker with the leaves on. So the way you do it is you, you start on the back of the tree and you just, you just go into it just enough, watch the top real close, and when it starts to tip, then just stop. And you want it to be connected like this so this cambium layer here will still bring in moisture and that'll keep the leaves on the tree you know, throughout the summer. And then <clears throat> what you'll have on this stump here is you'll have root suckers come off, up off of it. And you know, in years down the line, there'll be trees that you can hinge cut later on to add to that cover. But you know, in the meantime, that first summer, you'll actually have sprouts come up you know, on the stem of the, of the tree that you hinge cut. And the reason we picked this one is, you know, it's muscle wood, it, it's never gonna amount to anything. You know, you don't wanna take the nice trees in your woods, you know, the valuable trees and do this with, you know, so if you're in doubt, ask advice. And the other thing I'd like to explain is the safety part of it. This is a very dangerous way to cut trees. So, and it doesn't matter if it's this size or, you know, something 20 inches. You, you're cutting the wrong way, so you really got to be careful. When this tree starts to tip, you know, get away, because what's going to happen? You know, this is a smaller one, and it's a mini version of it, but you'll have a barber chair like this. And if it's a bigger tree, what will happen is it'll roll. And, you know, if it rolls your way and you're standing here, you know, you're going to be in the, in the path of the tree. So, anyways, you're, you really want to be careful doing the cutting this way.